Good morning, you beautiful people, and today we are again at my local Walmart, and uh, we're gonna go in. So last week I found this on the shelf. So many and Evolving Skies Elite Trainer boxes. There's three of them here on the shelf. Yeah, some uh, Evolving Skies Elite Trainer boxes. So today we're gonna go in and see if we can find some Evolving Skies. Hopefully some Elite Trainer boxes. I heard a lot of people in the comments say, why didn't you pick up that Evolving Skies? And it's been on my mind literally ever since then. So <laughs> we're gonna go in and see if we can find some and as well as some Crown Zenith. And yeah, let's just go see what they have a week after um, my last video. So let's go see. All right, so we are heading back to the back of Walmart. Unfortunately, up front, the workers were kind of watching me and I felt uncomfortable trying to make a video up there, but let's see if we can find anything back here. And it looks like they do have quite a bit of stock and looky there, an Evolving Skies Elite Trainer box, guys. Oh my gosh, and then Pikachu V boxes galore, some V-Star boxes, Shining Fates. Um, there's a collector's chest and look, we got some a lot of these tins here. Glade, Giratina. Some more of these stackable tins. Not sure what to get. I know I'm gonna get that Evolving Skies. And what are these? We got two pack blisters with uh, Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno. Looks like you get a Astral Radiance and Silver Tempest pack. Those are $11.98 for two packs. That's a little bit too much. A couple check lane blisters and some more of these smaller tins. Um, oh, we got some mini tins here too. Wonder what packs are inside of those. Um, so I know I'm going right, to get this so, Evolving Skies uh, ETB. It didn't look like they had a restock sure. since last week. If they did, it got picked over pretty quickly. I did not video in the front of the store. Um, I apologize for that. But there was, I guess, a lot of people have been stealing product lately. So the, the workers were just, like, all standing there just watching me like a hawk. So I felt awkward trying to get a video, get the uh, phone out and video some stuff. But uh, really, if you guys watched my last video... Um, and I'll leave a link to that in the, in the description below. Um, it pretty much looked exactly the same. Besides, there were there were no uh, loose packs and there were no uh, Crown Zenith mini tins, unfortunately. Um, but we did snag uh, some Crown Zenith and uh, some Evolving Skies. So uh, let's go back to the ripping room and see what we could pull. Meet you back there. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Jay's Pokey Stop and welcome back to the ripping room. So if you guys. It's, uh, if you guys seen all of that stock there at Walmart, we picked up, of course, an Evolving Skies Elite Trainer Box. You guys were hounding me from my last video for not picking one up, and they only had one today. So we lucked out and were able to pick up one. And of course, like I said, I wanted to open up some more Crown Zenith. So I snagged one of these Reggie Licky, Reggie Lecky uh, V boxes. And since we only were able to find one Evolving Skies Elite Trainer Box today. I'm going to go ahead and throw in one from my sealed collection too. So we're going to rip two of them today as well as the Reggie Alecki V Box, guys. So buckle down and let's dive into it. <laughs> that is very cringy. <laughs> but uh, we'll, we'll start with the Crown Zenith Reggie Alecki V Box. I'm going to go ahead and crack, uh, crack this open real quick and get the packs out. I'll see you in a second. All right, we got the box cracked open. Four Crown Zenith packs. Let's go ahead and dive right into it, guys. If you guys, uh, if you've seen all that uh, footage in Walmart, what would you have picked up in this video? Um, unfortunately, like I said there in the intro, I was not able to record in the front, but if you do want to see what they had, basically, you just have to go back to my last video and see what they had. Like I said, the workers were like watching me like a hawk. Like I was the person in there. There we go, we got Lunatone. I was the person in there stealing stuff. Like, no, nope, definitely paying for it. I, my bank account knows I've been paying for it. There's the code card. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, they were watching me like a hawk. I guess someone going in there at seven in the morning just to buy Pokemon cards. <laughs> they thought that might be unusual. They don't get it. They don't understand. <laughs> All right, next pack here. We did pull gold out of one of these boxes, so hopefully we can get some hits. We got Skrelp, 
and a ditto hollow. Couple hollow hits. I'm really hoping we could pull something spicy out of these Evolving Skies Leaf Trainer boxes. Now I am gonna keep the pack separate. I, I would like to see which ones, if we do hit something, which ETB it comes out of. If it's the last ETB, ETB that was on the shelf, or the one that was sitting on my desk for a while. <laughs> we got Meowth and Azarude, another hollow. All right, last pack of Crown Zenith. Unfortunately, they did not have any mini tins. Those are selling out very quickly. I even stopped at my local uh, LGS last night, and uh, they did not have any either. So, uh, fortunately, it's a hot item. We got a Berserker. So, nothing out of that uh, little box there. That's fine. We got two Evolving Skies Elite Trainer boxes. I'm going to go ahead and bust these open the same way and get the packs out. So I will meet you all back here in just a second. Let's get it. <clears throat> all right, we are back. We got both boxes cracked open. 16 packs total of Evolving Skies. Now this first box here is from the Walmart I just purchased. So um, see if someone left behind an ETB with a Moombreon in it. Wouldn't that be crazy? First pack, we got Teddy Ursa, Gigalith, and a Sharpedo. Woo! Finally opened some more Evolving Skies. <clears throat> Hope y'all are having a fantastic week so far. Hopefully by the time you guys are watching this, I have some news about my new job. Um, I did have a second interview, so um, and I think it went pretty well, but uh, we'll see. We'll have to see what's going on. I'll... Uh, Definitely keep you guys in the loop. I know some of y'all are very curious on uh, on what I do and, and stuff like that. So uh, I'll definitely, I'm, I want to be open with you guys. So I'll let y'all know as soon as I find out. Very exciting stuff. I'm very excited. New journey for me. We got Woobat and a Gore Guys. But of course, I'm, I want something that's not going to require me to stop making these videos. I love making these videos. I don't care how much money I make off of them. I just like making them. I'm gonna open Pokemon cards regardless. Um, so I might as well share it with the community. We got Time Pool, Bass, and a Gigalith, non-hollow. But uh, yeah, um, I'll definitely keep y'all posted on that. Come on, Evolving Skies. Maybe I should have left you on the shelf. I think I see a border in this one. Definitely do. We got Petalil. <laughs> Freaking garbage. Oh my gosh. Come on. We gotta have something better than that. Garbage VMAX. My dogs are tearing something apart behind me. We got an Evolving Skies pack. <laughs> Just the pack though, not the cards. <laughs> we got Psyduck. Tropius non hollow. Wow. These are rough. I was hoping they would have they uh, Walmart would have had a bunch of loose packs. I would have rather went that route. We would have got a lot more bang for the buck. We probably would have got 10 packs for the price of this ETB. Or close to 10 packs for the price of this ETB. So um, but unfortunately they were sold out. Of course. We got Woop uh, Wobbuffet. Suicune V, that's a solid V card. We'll take that. Last pack from the Walmart ETB. Come on. We gotta get something spicy. Evolving Skies being Evolving Skies, right? We got Psyduck and an Eldegoss. Nothing spicy out of that one. So the first ETB there, we got garbage, literally. Garbador B Max. Wow. Such a solid hit. Solid hit. Alright. Moving into the ETB that I had sitting here on my desk collecting dust. See if I was savoring up that Moonbryon. See if it was just sitting back there watching me all the, during all these openings. We got Swablu, Dialga Hollow. We got Ray Ray on the front here. Are y'all excited for Scarlet and Violet? 
they've been leaking, uh, or actually Pokemon posted pictures of the new cards with the gray borders. Um, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. I, I know I've asked this before, but actually being able to see the cards now, what are your thoughts? Do you, are, have your thoughts changed? Um, do you like them now? Do you not like them now? We got Zorua. Um, I personally still like them. I think it's it's fresh. It's new. Um, it's something. Uh, I, I like it. I like it. I think it's a good change. Um, yeah, I think the cards look great. The EX alternate arts are also looking very spicy. Very good. Can't wait to pull some of those. Hopefully pull some of those. <laughs> We got Cutifly. I wonder what the hit rates are going to be like, though. Are they still going to be terrible, like Evolving Skies? Who knows? Are they going to be more like Crown Zenith? We got so much, so many questions. So many questions. Can't wait uh, for the end of March is when it comes out, finally, for English. So we'll definitely be opening some of that on the channel. So stay tuned for that, y'all. Come on, this ETB is looking rough. I definitely probably should have kept it sealed. Definitely probably should have kept it sealed. Watch us not even get a V card out of this sucker. We got three packs after this one. We got Eevee. Ah, flying apple. That damn flying apple. <laughs> I swear. Come on. Get something spicy. We got three hits to show for. Out of two ETBs and a collection box. We got Fletchling. Umbreon. I'll take Umbreon. It's not the Umbreon, Umbreon we want, though. Not even close, but it, I'll take it. I'll take it. The set is ruthless, I swear. Code card. We got Emolga, Reggie Drago, and another Emolga Reverse. All right, last pack, guys. What a rough opening. Oh, my gosh. You guys got to hit that like button for me on this one. I need it. I need it. <laughs> All right, Duraludon on the last pack here. Wish me happy or good luck on my last pack here. Last pack magic. Can we pull something extra spicy? There is the code. We got Carvana. Is that another garbage? Oh my God. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. Evolving Skies, you've, you've done me dirty. Out of all the love I've given you, and you hit me with garbage twice. Twice. Check out these hits from two Elite Trainer Boxes, guys. Which is why I left them on the shelf in my last video, if you if you may ask. Check that out. Oh my god, that is so bad. Crown Zenith couldn't even save the day. We got a Lunatone. Wow, guys. Like I said, hit that like for me. <laughs> Only way to cheer me up is to hit that like button. Uh, <laughs> But that's going to do the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like these kind of hunting videos, let me know uh, down in the comments below. Um, also, by hitting that subscribe button and like button. It, it really tells me you guys enjoy these videos, and I'll I'll keep making some for sure. I enjoy making them. Um, maybe I can start doing some kind of uh, every Saturday morning I go out and hunt at this same Walmart and see kind of how the stock changes um, in and out of or every week, you know? I think that'd be pretty interesting to see. Um, but, uh, yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, we'll catch you next time on Jay's Pokestop. Peace out.